Hi, have you ever wondered why the letter Q is almost always followed by the letter U? Well, in Spellable Land, in Spellable City, the letters are represented by animals. So R for rooster, M for moose, Q for the queen ant, and U for unicorn. Hey Moose, what do you get when you put a cow in a tornado? I don't know. What'd you get? A milkshake! Ah oh, ha 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 ha! Ow! Please don't step on me! Please! What? What is that? It looks like something... Hmm, I better not say. It looks like something yummy to me. I might. What are you? I'm a Q. I'm a queen ant. I came here to help you. To help you guys spell different letters, different words that have the letter Q in them. But, well, does anyone know you're here yet? No, I don't, I don't think so. You're the first animals I've met. Oh, well, in that case, What are you doing? Oh, rude rooster. I should have known that would be you. And Moose, are you guys being mean? Help, please help. They, they were trying to eat me. Or the rooster was. I'm so scared. I just came here to help. Don't worry, queen. I know who you are. I'm the one who sent for you. And we've been waiting from now on. No matter, <laughs> no matter um, what word you're in, I will be with you to protect you from the bullies that might try to get you because you're so little or for any other reason. I will be your guardian. And my hands... <laughs> oh. And that is why every time you see a Q in a word, you'll see the letter U right behind